my screen because we have to start with, well, we're going to use a PowerPoint tonight because uh, that is much easier uh, for us to keep everything in line. So first thing we're going to do tonight is we are going to start off by recognizing all the people who have stepped up to manager in April already. So look at all of these people. This list is amazing. Um, I don't know offhand if there are... There is, well, there's a few from Melanie Miller's team, so that's great. Um, I don't know if any of them are here tonight, but they might be able to see this in Salesforce later. So congratulations. This is so exciting. And we have a few new star managers. Again, super, super exciting. Nancy Watmore, I know she's here tonight. So congratulations to Nancy. And uh, really what we want to show you guys with all of this, you're probably thinking, well, we're all consultants. Why are we recognizing the people who've stepped up? Because if they can do it, so can you. So um, next, I'm going to introduce a good friend, Debbie Dufault. She sent in a video to do some video training with you guys tonight. So I'm going to play Debbie's video, and then we are going to... Uh, I'll, I'll continue on with the, the training. So just let me know if you can't hear it, Genevieve, okay? Hello to you, everybody. I'm super happy that I get to train you guys in English. Yes, it's been a privilege for the past two weeks now. So uh, even if it's my second language, I'll try to make it really inspiring This is because this is kind of my part here. So I'm going to show you a video. And I just, wanted, I just want you to listen to it with your uh, ears open. I want you to be open-minded. I want you to be letting the emotion come in and spark something in you. Because even if we are Friday and the month is ending tomorrow on Saturday, I want you to realize that still anything is possible if I decided, uh, decided to. So I want you to understand that also every action counts. And even if you're not uh, reaching the, that ultimate goal that you were aiming for, um, you're going to still be proud that you did a little bit more and a little bit more and a little bit more because that ultimate goal was clear. So do you want to reach that 1,800 personal sales? Do you want to go up a level? Are you missing one or two recruits in order to have that to happen? So it's all a question of uh, what is your attitude and how you're feeling the next few hours. So let's share my screen right here and watch a video of uh, what uh, you should be aiming for. If the lion is the king of the jungle, how can he be the king of the jungle? If he's not the biggest, the elephant is probably one of the biggest. He can't be the fastest because that's a cheat. He can't be the smartest. So he's not the biggest, the fastest, or the smartest. So how does the lion become the king of the jungle? The difference of a lion and an elephant. When a lion walks up and sees an elephant, he thinks run. He thinks run. When a male lion walks up, he may be outnumbered by a pack of hyenas, but I'm king of my jungle because of my mentality. Man. So, do you have a lion attitude right now? Do you have the mentality that you're always going to win any way you, um, anything you're going to touch is going to transform into a success? Do you have that? positive minding right now and that will be a key difference in the people that are going to get to their uh, objective and the people that are going to be staying at this exact same place that they are right now so today just want to inspire you by um let your emotion go inside of you really really high to reach your heart to reach your head to reach your 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 core here and and feeling it um, and that emotion I want that want that I want you to be your lifesaver right now that you're gonna hang on to is the emotion of um, the, the proudness that the emotion of um, the 
how are you going to feel when you reach that? So make maybe with that pen and paper, write down what will be your reaction of you uh, reaching your ultimate goal for tomorrow night at 11.59. So write it down and make it like something that you're feeling inside, okay? I'm going to show you the rest of my PowerPoint. I have a few little things I want to um, bring your attention to. Imagine it's like a, a set of stairs, okay? It's a really high set of stairs. And there's the ultimate prize on top. But if you decide, mean in the mean, in the middle of that staircase that you're going to sit and it's not for you to reach that goal, you're right. It's all about cre creating the vision that it is an option for you. So be careful what you are telling your brain right now okay so make it like a, a mountain and there's the belly there on top you will never go on a hike without going to reach the top what is the the objective now but that training that you're going to get while you're going to the top is already a reward uh, even if you do not reach it because you get too tired or something, at least you try. So that's what I want to uh, bring your attention to because it is so important for me um, to uh, have you inspired because I saw, I've been in the business for eight years now. I saw so much miracle happen in the last few hours just because the mindset was there. So I'm going to give you back to my friend Caitlin right here. Just remember, that um, that by reaching the top, you're gonna be really, really, really uh, proud of yourself, but also you're gonna serve as a mentor and uh, as a um, image or a vision or role model for all the people that you recruited in your team, to all your family that's looking at you, looking that all your effort is paying. So, Back to you, Kaylin. Okay. Just going to pause it for one second. Let's see. Genevieve, do you think that I have that option on my Zoom? I don't know. I think they remove. Okay, continue your training and we will check after because we have only 30 minutes and we have nine, nine minutes left. Okay, where are we? Okay, so. Ah, how do we get past her? Okay. So I hope you were able to hear Debbie's message in that, uh, in her little video there for you and uh what she really wants to drive home what we're trying to let you guys know is speak with emotion like find your goal figure out what you want to do speak with emotion speak with passion in your voice uh about what you want to do and how you want to get there now you can you have to remember though that the only thing you can really control you can't control the results at the end right the only thing you can control is your actions and how you act with those actions so your action changes things. So you need to remember that as you uh, move forward with your goal. So how are you going to make the goal if you don't know where you're sitting with your goal, right? So you have to go into your progress tracker, and this is found on your homepage of your pink part of your uh, website. And so what you're going to see in that uh, progress tracker is you're going to be able to see uh, how close you are to the next level. So you're going to see if you have personal sales, how much your personal sales are versus how much they need to be. Because every level, including being a director, you have to have a minimum of $600 in personal sales each month to get paid as that title. You need to check if you've got uh, recruits that you need to add in. It'll tell you how many recruits do you have. You're going to see your unit sales. So this a uh, little progress tracker is going to be your best friend for the next uh, just over 24 hours as we get ready to close off and for you to get closer and closer to those goals. Um, 
the other thing that we need to do is uh, we need to know why. Why are we doing all of this? So to remind you, I'm going to give you a whole bunch of reasons here why you want to step up to that next level. Um, so again, of course, the pay. Who isn't here for the pay? Everyone would take extra money, I think, right? Um, so there's a pay increase when you move up to manager. So you're going to make 2% of 75% of, of your team sales. You're going to get a step up bonus. You're going to qualify for your Vanguard bonus, which is uh, calculated based off of your team sales each and every month. Uh, you're going to get invited to special trainings like the SFL. Uh, you're going to get to enter into the manager growth program. Now, about that manager growth program, if you move up to manager this month, you fast track yourself to that iPad. So you get to skip month one in the new program, you move right into month two, and then you're that much closer to getting the iPad. So who doesn't want a free iPad? Woo! <laughs> yes! So I was lucky. I was one of the people who uh, made it all the way through the Confidence Start program. And guess what? I'm kicking myself now for it, but I chose the iPad. I didn't take the pots and pans set. Um, so the, the iPads are amazing. Uh, we use it daily around here. Um, the other thing is that Tupperware has all kinds of amazing rewards for you guys to cash in on. So this month, if you move up uh, from a consultant to a manager, you get an exclusive award that, that not anybody can get. You have to step up to be able to get this. So this is an amazing bag. Uh, who sees going to the beach with this bad boy? Me! I think it's so great for that. Um, you get, again, invited to some trainings that you only get invited to when you are a leader. So you get the manager training, you get uh, that SFL that we were talking about, and there's already 201 registrations. That means that there's only 99 spots left for people to get a surprise box. And for someone who doesn't even like surprises, I'm so glad that I'm already registered because I want all that product. So don't delay. Step up now so that you know that you can come to the SFL and get that surprise box. So you're going to maximize your pay. You're going to maximize your rewards. But the next thing that you're going to do is work towards becoming a great leader. And great leaders help other people succeed. So I put this little quote in here to inspire you because the greatest success we'll know is helping others succeed and grow, right? So... Uh, we're going to talk about the Confidence Start program. You're probably thinking, well, how does that have anything to do with helping other people, uh, lead, like being a better leader? You have to realize where your recruits are. Your recruits might be so overwhelmed in the system that they have no idea that they're even in the Confidence Start program. So you want to keep tracking the Confidence Start program, and you're going to want to make sure that they know about that change that's coming up in the Confidence Start program. So right now, if they have 12, if they're uh, nearing that $1,200 mark within the first 60 days of their business, they're going to get an $80 credit in their account to use towards their next order. But after the system shut down and we reopen with Gen Con, it's not going to be a credit anymore. It's going to be the choice of the Thatsable three-piece set or the modular meat ovals. So you're going to want to let them know that they could maximize on that, especially if they're getting close. The, uh, we have some scripts prepared. They're all going to go up for you in Salesforce so that you guys have uh, basically a copy-paste text, but this isn't a copy paste thing. Like we're not expecting you to send all of this by messenger. We want you to talk to them because the more passion, the more emotion that you show in your voice when you're speaking to people, the more they're going to be receptive to what is happening. Um, you want to talk about the consistency uh, award that's happening. So you're going to track that, see if they're close, see where they're sitting and uh, go from there. The next script that we have again is going to help you talk to them about that consistency award. Um, so I'm just going to make sure. Okay. So you want to uh, talk to them about that consistency award. Make sure that they know that it's a thing because maybe they haven't been checking their emails from Tupperware. Maybe they haven't come to the meetings and hear their directors talk about that consistency award. If they can, if they realize that they can earn a frying pan for free and they're so close to getting to that level, they might as well. You also need to remember that at $1,800, they get their $50 uh, 
uh, personal sales volume bonus. So if they're, if they're only like 10 or $20 away, of course it's worth it for them to put in those sales to make sure that they get that personal sales volume bonus. Um, you, the coupons. So Melanie touched on this briefly uh, beforehand. So there are very limited coupons that are, that are in the system right now. And you can track that. If you have recruited somebody, you have a unit underneath you, you can track that and see who hasn't redeemed their coupons that are in the system right now. So you want to make sure that you go out there and you talk to them about that smooth chopper coupon or any of the coupons they might have sitting in their system. And again, we've prepared you with some scripts so that you know how to talk to them about it. Another thing to note here is offering to help them. Maybe they haven't redeemed it because they just don't understand how. We know that the system isn't very user-friendly. The more that you offer to help them, the more willing they're going to be to uh, get into action and help you with your goals. So if you're not able to help them because time doesn't permit, there are people in your team, I'm sure of it, that will help you because everybody here in our community wants to see other people level up. Um, so you've got, these scripts are gonna go out for you. Now, I can't, uh, I'm gonna hand it back to Debbie. She's gonna do another video. It's about six minutes and then we're gonna close off. Thank you, Kaylin. So you all were inspired to uh, call your team, to messenger your team, to give all your energy and excitement to your team. Now I want you to feel that everybody around you is open to help you. You just have to ask. And that's a problem that we all have inside. We have some limitation already we deciding that people will say no so please again be open-minded that everybody's going to say yes it's all a question of attitude and it's all going to be a success so i'm going to share my screen right here and bring you to uh the powerpoint again i want you to ask for help yes and i want you to say i'm i'm gonna give you the chance to help me. So I need you to help me. That's the wording I want you to use, not maybe you can help. No, 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 no. I want you to help me. I chose you to be the one that would be proud that you made something uh, possible for me. Okay, so you have to extend a hand. You don't know how you'll be that sunshine to somebody because you ask them to have a purpose for a day, okay? So what you can ask, again, I'm going to have Claudia as an example, but I want you to have that list before you go to sleep tonight of those 10 people you're going to ask and to extend a hand. So if ever you um, you will want to have those as scripts, yes. Otherwise, you can also uh, at any time take a screenshot of what you see. So hi, Claudia. I hope you're doing well. I know that I hope you noticed that I became a Tupperware. I'm having so much fun. Anyway, I wanted you um, to uh, help me. I wanted you to uh, to do something for me, okay? And if ever it is something that is possible, I want you maybe test around you the water if somebody needs anything. Because I'm at the end of the month and now you have to say your objective, your, uh, your ultimate goal. And I'm trying to reach uh, another level i'm trying to level up what do you think do you think today you can take a look up of the options and then you listen and then you listen try to understand or do not be ready with the answer right now with your uh fears closed okay be ready to um to add some information on top of what she or he said okay and ask more precisely of how you can have those results, okay? Maybe you can check around. If I send you the special, you send it to a couple of people. And maybe if it's uh, something that, maybe for you, you need something. Maybe people around you need something. I'm going to send you a gift to thank you because it's going to make a really big difference in my ultimate goal. If you say yes, say thank you. I appreciate it. I'm going to send you it, I send you to it right now and take you 
for making the magic happen. If she said no, thank you anyway. It's been fun to talk because I'm on a journey of success right now. I'm going to go to the next one, but again, we'll have the chance to, um, to talk another time. Okay, so this is one way to ask for help. Otherwise, you can put the challenge on Tupperware's back. So that could be fun in order to, um, to have the people around you helping you to reach um, a Tupperware challenge. So um, I have a challenge to have more people in my um, VIP group. So maybe it could be fun for you to participate. I'm going to do a draw so you decide on whatever draw you want to do. And maybe you can go live on your group and tell I'm going to do a draw of every people that add people to. You have now the options of the salt pepper shaker. Tomorrow, you won't have, not, not tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, those will not exist anymore. So I said, just I had $1.50. What are you going to do today and tomorrow in order to, um, to maximize them? And uh, maybe you can add people in the group. Maybe they will be the one buying from me. Maybe you will be the one. Maybe they will be the one winning. Okay, so I hope it's going to help you to have those vocabulary. I hope you know how the function on Messenger works. There's a little microphone next to picture option right there. Okay, so push on it. Don't worry to uh, to use your voice. It's going to be really more... Um, I don't. I know Melanie Miller does not work like this work. It's going to be contaminating with all your energy and smile. Um, but uh, it's not the same thing as a just a copy and paste text. But you can use that as an inspiration. And the last one could be also to decide to thank everybody that helped you with sales and do a draw. You can decide to. Um, have people that it helped you with recruitment, it helped you with um, players, new players in your uh, in your group. Anything is good, just have to be personalized. And maybe if you have trouble, trouble with the wording and, and stuff, perfect. Just do like this, woo! send their, all the energy in, and then you go live, or then you open your mic, and then just remember to do it maybe in front of the mirror, and ask yourself, would you say yes to yourself? Do you sound boring? Do you sound yourself like we're helping you by saying no? Or do we feel that is so clear for you where you're going that we want to have our little um, add on to this success? Okay. So now <laughs> we're going to talk about, uh, like, we're going to talk about the action. What are you guys going to do? So we gave you a goal. We gave you motivation, I hope. And uh, we're going to give you a script. So we're going to talk about the tools. And I thought this quote was really, really fitting uh, because it says, give people the right tools and they will design and build the most extraordinary things. Pretty good, huh? All right. So these are the things that you can do to help you with your goal. So again, closing all those Tupper Connect parties. Uh, don't let any of the Tupper Connect rewards go to waste. Optimize those parties out by using your pool balance. Optimize your half off items. They count in your sales. So I do something personally all the time. Every single time that I have a half off item that's to be redeemed, um, I put it in my VIP and I say, I have these seven items available at half off. It's the seven highest priced items in our, in our brochure. And I say, who would like one? And I get them to tell me what they want. And then I go in the random wheel and I pick somebody and away we go so that I'm maximizing that half off item as they go through my sales. Uh, do some auctions, generate sales, lives, uh, talk about recipes, do bingos, auctions, draws, talk about Mother's Day and Father's Day, gifts for teachers and educators. Um, and in Salesforce, we have created an album for you guys. So you just have to go into photos, albums, um, 
sorry, media, photos, albums, and there's a, an album called Games. And there are all kinds of different raffles, bingos, draws uh, that you guys can do on your VIP pages this weekend, uh, well, tomorrow, to try to help you close off and get to that goal. Um, there's all of the stuff that we're used to seeing in our after meeting split. So you've got your fundraiser opportunities. You've got, uh, of course, doing a Facebook party. You have tons of time to execute a 24 hour Facebook party. It is so much fun. There are so many reasons to do um, the Facebook party. They're very simple. Maximize those rewards for yourself or for uh, other people if you're into a mystery hostess. Doing a squirrel buy if you're going to uh, have prizes to give away or want to do like uh, surprise bags for your clients. You can say $100 bags for $40 um, or $100 bags for $50 and then buy all of this product. And again, your directors have all of the slides that you need to know how to put this all in for you. Um, but basically, the biggest and best way to get yourself out there is going live. So doing a live, talking about recruiting with the welcome offer, doing a live to talk about the kit. If you are a brand new kit buyer and you get that kit in your hands, do a live with that kit so people can see what they are missing out on. Um, do a live for the $20 opportunity because as far as we know, it's ending. So there's like a little over 24 hours to go using that kit. Do a live about how much you made. You know, um, I was asked to calculate today what I've made from January to today. And I was shocked when I pulled that number up and it was $16,000. So talk about that. I plan on going live to talk about that because that's insane to me. Do uh, a live about the lifestyle and what it has done for you. So um, we have all of this stuff this isn't new. This is all stuff you're going to see in the split after. Um, and then we've got things, posters like this that are in Salesforce as well. This or that. It gives people the idea to figure out the cost difference for buying uh, the kit versus buying just one single product that they might have their eye on. Um, the Utopic Shore collection. This is a gift from Tupperware that is $1,000 cumulative from your recruits who have been recruited between January, February, and March. So in the month of April, anyone you have recruited in January, February, and March has to, their orders have to add up to $1,000 for you to get this. So if you've got like just a little bit more, get on those people, get them to help you out by putting in some orders. And if you have questions on placing orders and you can't figure out where to go, definitely go to the Lay GMA website. In the members area, there are tons of courses in there for you to put that up. So last thing for tonight, I want to know what? Okay, last thing that we have, uh, I want to know where are you guys going to be? Are you going to go partway up the steps and, and wonder if you actually can make it happen? Or are you going to be at the top of the steps or at least nearing the top of those steps, congratulating yourself because you did it? The last thing I'm going to say is that there are 40 some of you here tonight. So I hope, I hope, and I know Debbie's with me on this one, putting my hand over my heart for conviction. I hope that we are seeing 40 of you step up between now and the end of the month tomorrow night. So you guys can do it. Remember, keep the passion, talk to people. Don't just post a poster, have real conversations because the more those conversations are real, the more chance you're going to have success. That's it.